The reason I would have chose the higher cert in food science and management was that my background after finishing school was to work in kitchens. I had worked as a chef for over 10 years. Decided I wanted to get a little bit more deeper into the knowledge of food. For me personally, I think that the lab side of it I really did enjoy, but I, from speaking to other students, they enjoyed the practical side of the actual cookery of food. I think my favourite part of the course would have been diversity of students that were involved in the course. I'd say about 10% of us would have been mature students. I'd say about maybe another 10% would have just finished school and the rest of the students would have been maybe three or four years out of school that had decided to go and do a two-year course. When I finished the higher cert in food science and management, I decided to move into the nutraceutical course. That was a level eight course and I finished that out with first class honours, which gave me a fairly good opportunity for jobs. I've worked in uh, some, some roles such as specifications technologist, new product development technologist, and I've had uh, ad administration roles as well. I feel this course it, it really suit anybody that is a, has a genuine interest in food. Again, there's so many different aspects to this course. It's not just food related, there's regulatory affairs. So if you're interested in the regulatory side of food applications, again, the business side as well, and there was also a maths course as well, maths for scientists, which we would have taken in elements of even physics involved in that as well. So I think it's a very broad course and it's a great stepping stone course for anybody that's looking to get involved.